Hi, this is an instructional video on how to use a Rhizodeg pen. So first of all, your physician might prescribe you with an insulin injection. And this is safe when it is in this prescribed dose. Um, prior to misconceptions before that if you're on insulin, it's already on your late stage or it's the end or your diabetes is so worse that there's no turning back insulin is really quite safe when used properly safe so safe that that it is the only one approved for use in pregnancy okay but in today's video we will discuss about how to use a rhizodeg pen so a rhizodeg pen first before you use you always check if it's expired Okay, and let's say your physician prescribes you with 16 units. If you notice, your insulin is clear, so there's no need to shake. Your insulin will be stable in room temperature once you open it for about 30 days. So let's say your physician prescribes you with 20 units at breakfast. So what you do is you put the needle first. And then dispense two units, one, two. One click is equivalent to one unit and dispose of that. There's no needle now because this is just a demo pen. But once the needle is there, you will see a tiny dot of insulin, which means that the needle you put is patent. So it will release a dollop of insulin and this number will go back to zero. And that's when you proceed to dial the desired dose. So let's say your physician says 20. Okay. So 20, one click, is one unit. Let's say you made a mistake. Just turn it back. It's okay. So 20 units. And then you hold it like this. So if you notice, it's more stable Like if you hold it like this rather than holding it like this and holding it like this. Where do you inject? usually in the abdomen so two finger breaths from your belly button you do not inject because that's the area where it's less fat and you do need fat okay so that's why you inject it in the abdomen you can make a grid or you can imagine a grid and about two finger breaths from the belly button that's when you start to inject so your whole abdomen is okay um just space it a little bit, about two finger breaths from each insulin injection. So in a month, maybe you can inject once in that site. And then the next injection on that same site will be about 30 days later. It also depends if you're prescribed it twice a day. So this one, when the physician says, okay, inject it 20 units at breakfast. So once your food is ready, that's when you set up your insulin. Rather than injecting your insulin and then you order your food, you wait your, for your food and you cook for your food, that's now how it is to be done. So your Rhizodeg pen is a combination of a fast-acting insulin and a long-acting insulin. It's specifically mixed so that you don't have to shake it visibly and you don't have to roll it like the Novomix pen. The Novomix pen is made by the same manufacturer. So Rhizodeg pen, when the food is already there, you set your prescribed dose and inject. Let's say this is your abdomen. Just inject and then press and then you wait for a few seconds, maybe about 6 to 7. Or you wait until the sound is finished. It means that it has dispensed all its insulin and then you remove it slowly. Okay, No need to jab the insulin on your skin it will puncture make sure you use a new needle every time if you're super you want really want to save then you can use the needle maybe twice but if you move, use it more than twice then it will be blunt and that's more painful ideally you use it once and there's no pain okay after that just recap remove the needle recap and that's it and enjoy your day Thank you for watching and let me know if you have any other 
issues okay